Alrighty, here we go. Whoops. Too zoomed in. Pattern-collections.com is where we need to find our pattern of the day. I'm going to go down here and it's hex triangle grid, um, which is base pattern. Um, so it's a, it's a hexagonal pattern, but basically you draw the hexagon and then you just draw your lines across it and then you fill in every other one like you do with um, a checkerboard type pattern okay uh, or in a variation you can um, do the lines slightly bigger to, to one side you see how it kind of almost makes a spiral like that or you can shade instead of coloring in um, but if you'll notice you can see the the hex but then you can also see the triangles and that they make straight lines like this so I had a thought don't know if it's gonna work but we're gonna we're gonna try things because that's what I do I experiment right so I'm going to use my straight edge, which I almost never use, and I'm going to give myself, well first off I'm going to give myself a border. And that's not really straight, but you know, it is what it is. Just so I don't get too close to the edge, because I don't like to get close to the edge. But I'm going to start at this line. Can you even see that line that I drew? Probably not. Yeah, a little bit. I'm going to make it just a slightly bit darker. I'm going to start at that line and I am going to put this guy here. And I'm going to draw around him. Like that. Okay. Now I should be able to draw that line and I should be able to draw this line and this line and this one and this one right and this one should end up same angle right okay now I've got those lines already and then I can put another one of these next to this pretty close and just do this one this one and this one right Those lines are already there. This is much more, um, much less organic than I usually do.
any of these hex ones just are not really my thing but I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm doing my best should be building more hexes as I go down there, right? Should be. So this is one here. And that's the first one I drew. And there's one here. I want to actually see them at the end of my of my drawing so um, I want to make sure that they're all there so that's going to be my Now I think I don't want all of them. I want to make an interesting composition. So I don't think I want to indicate. I think I want one there. And then I think I want one here. And then I think maybe here. So I want one here and here and here like that. And then I think compositionally I'm going to put one out here. Like that. Okay, that's what I'm going to do. Like this piece is falling out or slipped out or whatever. Let's try that. So I think I actually am going to draw them in my big pen. I want to see this hexagon shape. Now, if you were doing this freehand, this is how you would draw it freehand. You would do lines this way vertical, 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 and then in between you would go vertical, 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 and then you would draw this sort of Y shape here and here, here and here.
I know how to do it freehand. I just, if I want them to be more symmetrical, I can't. Because I am a non-symmetrical kind of gal. And you'll notice, even though I used all that technology, all those tools, they're still not perfectly straight, but that's okay. Alright, so now I want to... I want to emphasize these triangles, but I think what I want to do is actually... Um, let me use my thinner pen. I'm going to go ahead and draw these lines, but then I'm going to aura them, I think. finish this one. This will be the last one for the week. And then, oops, you guys can't see what I'm doing. God, jeez. I have got to stop doing that. I'm getting worse again. Uh, part of it has to, somehow when, when I put my camera equipment back up, something is still not quite right. The angle, something, something is not quite right. And I'm not 100% sure what it is. But it's just not quite right. Okay. I'm going to erase all those guidelines. There we go. And then... not working very well either. Sheesh. Me and my pens that don't work very well. I want... That didn't come out right. Why? I didn't do something right. Huh. Okay. It needed to be here. Alrighty then, I didn't do something right. What the heck? What did I just do? Okay. They're going to have three different shapes. I did something wrong. Okay. 
You know what this looks like? Trivial Pursuit. Remember that game? Some of them are going to be. That's good. I like that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to insinuate that this whole shape is one big solid. doing this. Some kind of board game pieces all hooked together. One's coming out. I don't know. It's fun. I want to I want to highlight some places though. Let's get some of that white in there because I really like it when there's white in there. That's fun. I still think it, I feel like it needs something. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this metallic green in here. I don't know why I want to do that. feel like it's it's like it's uh, in the middle of gameplay on some sort of game and that's why these uh, are slightly different because each player has earned a different 
color or scheme or peg or something as they move around the board. So not all the pieces are the same. Alex is appropriate. Okay, one, two of those. That's nifty. I like it. I'm, I'm happy with this. All right. You guys have a great day. I will see you tomorrow. I've got to go put my foot up for a while. So I'll be back probably tomorrow. We'll see what happens. Um, yeah. But putting my foot up for extended periods of time is getting really old. Just letting you know. It just is. And it's messing with my sleep schedule because I will fall asleep in the chair and have a nap. And then when I go to bed, I can't fall asleep because I've had a nap all afternoon. Oh, I forgot to sign this. There we go. That's better. Now it's done. Okay, you guys have a great day. I will go put my foot up, take care of myself. You take care of yourself, take care of others. Be good to somebody today, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.